Hello everyone, and welcome back to Oblivion. We are right where we left off, and uh, things are going pretty well, I might say. Um, and I think it is time for us to continue getting out of this cave. What do we have over here? Lock picks, pair of hammer. There's a two-handed weapon, but we won't be needing that. Senior Thark is a uh, sword and shield kind of guy. I always found this game a bit odd how, like, you go through for it for a while and then you choose your class. Like, it's very strange. You'll see here in a little bit. Once we get far enough in the game, then we get to choose our class. Because, unlike Skyrim, there are classes in this game. I don't really remember exactly what they do. I think it has something to do with, like, how quickly you level up certain skills, I believe. Can we take a look at our skills? Where's... How do we check our skills? Honestly, uh, is it here? Okay, there we go. Um, right. Yep, see, there's going to be a class... And then we also get a birth sign. What do we start with? We start with a better blunt, but our blade is almost as good as our blunt. Anyway, maybe we should have picked up one of those blunt weapons, but hey, the, the sword was better. Okay, so we're proficient in repairing armor. And heavy armor starts up nice and high because we're an orc, and uh, that is about everything, I believe. Let us continue. Ooh. You find the sensitive spot. Protect the Emperor until help arrives. Help? What makes you think help will get here before more of those bastards? We need to get the Emperor out of here. What's up, motherfucker? Oh yeah, got him. Yeah. Those have weight and no value, so I'll just... Damn it! It's that prisoner again! Kill him! He might be working the with fuck? the assassins! Hey! Leave no, me alone, asshole! he is not one of them. He can help us. He must help us. They cannot understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. What, the, the gay dream How you have about the two of us? Listen, you know the Nine. How they guide our fates with an invisible hand. Shh. Sure. Yeah, the Nine guide and protect us. Uh-huh. I've served the Nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked with numberless sparks, each a fire, and every one a sign. I know these stars well, and uh. I wonder... Which sign marked your birth? Here we get to choose our birth sign. Uh, this is kind of like the um, standing stones, but you only get to pick one. Strength and endurance. I haven't looked up like what's good to take and what isn't. So... Uh... That doesn't sound good. Not really what I'm looking for. Uh... Eh. Oh, these look great. I'm tending towards the warrior, I think. Uh, lock picking. Yeah, okay. Endurance and Strength. It's a classic. Yeah. The warrior. signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end, will come when it will come. Sure. And uh, I'm not going to die, right? Your stars are not mine. Today the warrior shall prove a stalwart companion when fortune fades.
Can you see my feet? My dreams grant me no opinions of success. Their compass ventures not beyond the doors of death. But in your face I behold the sun's companion. The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory may banish the coming darkness. You say so, man. With such hope, and with the promise of your aid, my heart must be satisfied. I don't really want to ask this. I'm an orc. I, I, I'm not afraid to die. Why should he be? But I don't really have a choice. No trophies of my triumphs precede me. But I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom, but not the hour. In this, I am blessed to see the hour of my death. That's one way to, to look at it. To face my apportioned fate, then fall. Yeah, whatever totes your goat, man. I go to my grave. A tongue shriller than all the music calls me. You shall follow me yet for a while. Then we must part. All right. You say so? You may as well make yourself useful. Here, carry this torch and stick close. Yeah, no thanks. Oh, there's an axe down stick there. Stick close and let us do our job. You'll be all right. Uh... Maybe I could have done that on his dialogue? I don't know, I don't remember. Was there an X down there? Maybe I was just being blind. Yeah, you can carry Not much farther. Yeah, okay, whatever. Let's go. You handled yourself pretty well back there. Just keep out of our way. Got it? Sure. Oh. Assassins. Oh! 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 Goodness. Any of them drop a mace? No. If I could get a mace, I'd switch over to it. Eh, maybe not. We'll see. The Emperor's in danger! You don't Jesus. want to do that again. Sorry, did I accidentally stab one of you guys? Didn't mean to. You're lucky I like you. Otherwise you'd be dead already. God, calm down, guys. Don't stand in the way of my blade. You know? Come on, Boris, let's get going. Hold up. I don't like this. Let me take a look. Yeah, you know, maybe our uh method of getting out of here isn't quite the best. Why would you go out on your own? Um, that door's open. You want to check it? No? Just going this Damn way? It. The gate is barred from the other side. A trap! What about that side passage back there? Worth a try. Let's go. Why, why would it be a trap the gate's locked because it's clearly like a sewer area like someone just forgot the key um well this is a trap hey guys it's, it's a, a dead, dead end. end what's your call sir they're behind us wait here sire wait here with the emperor guard him with your life for the Gunroy, over here I can go no further. You alone must stand against the Prince of Destruction and his mortal servants. He must not have the Amulet of Kings. Take the Amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him and close shut the jaws of Oblivion. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Jesus. No. Talos saved us. I blame you. We failed. I failed. Yep. The blades are sworn to protect the Emperor. Now he and all his heirs are dead. 
The amulet. Where's the amulet of kings? It wasn't on the emperor's body. Oh, uh, I took it. Strange. He saw something in you. Trusted you. Yeah, he had a weird they say dream. It's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every septum. They see more than lesser men. The amulet of kings is a sacred symbol of the empire. Most people think of the red dragon crown, but that's just jewelry. The amulet has power. Only a true heir of the blood can wear it, they say. He must have All given right. it to you for a reason. Did he say why? Aw, oh, man. I want to lie to this dude. Whatever. Joffrey? He said that? Why? There's another heir. Nothing I ever heard about. But Joffrey would be the one to know. He's the Grand Master of my order. Although you may not think so to meet him, he lives quietly as a monk at Wainan Priory, near the city of Coral. All right, where's that? First, you need to get out of here. Through that door must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. That's where we were heading. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City, or it was supposed to be secret. Yeah, here, clearly you'll not. You'll need this key for the last door into the sewers. The sewers? Wait, how? Did you not know there was a door back there? What? There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're an experienced knight. Am I right? Ah, quest. Um, choose class time. Right. Okay. Illusion. Speechcraft. Eh. I don't, I don't know. Let's take a look. Definitely not. Nope. Nope. No. Uh, no. No. Mm -mm. Restoration, athletics, blade, destruction, blunt, hand to hand, heavy armor. That's not bad. No. Block illusion, heavy armor, blunt blade, speech craft, hand to hand. So crusader's better than knight. Mage monk, knight blade, pilgrim, rogue, scout, sorcerer, spell sword. Nope. Warrior. Armor, athletics, blade, block, blunt. Hand to hand heavy armor. And knight was warrior to armor athletics. So a crusader gets heavy armor. Hand to hand blunt destruction. Okay, warrior's looking better, I think. Witch hunter, that's cool. Uh, not what I'm looking for, though. Armor, athletics, blade block, blunt, hand to hand. Oh, armorer. I guess that's repairing armor. Blade block, blunt. Yeah, okay, I think this is what we're looking for. Yeah. Warrior. Yes. I wasn't far off. In any case, rats and goblins won't give you any trouble. Uh, what's after the sewers? You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne in Priory immediately. Got it? Yeah, totally. Good. The Emperor's trust was well placed. Was it, though? Was it? I'll stay here to guard the Emperor's body and make sure no one follows you. You better get moving. May Talos guide you. By the way, thanks for recovering Captain Renault's sword. I'll see that it is given a place of honor in the Halls of the Blades. Ah, dicks. Uh. Oh, I think this is like a... DLC or something. Leave the Emperor. Okay. 
Yeah, okay, those are a couple DLCs popping up. All right, what do we have? Uh, oh, that's even... Shield Steel Shorts. Is this... That's a three weapon. That's even better than the blade. All right, I ain't even mad. Sure. Sounds good, I guess. Can I wear this? Ah, ah, okay. Well, I guess we're not the heir. Okay. Um. Okay, if there's a passageway here and you know that the this leads to the sewers, how did you not know that this passageway existed? Oh, okay, it, it wraps around. Oh, look, a chest. What do we got here? Potions. Gotta get used to clicking that take all button. All right, down to the sewers, down to the sewers. All right, more DLC popping up. Oh my God, so much DLC. So much DLC. Oh my God, it's just, why? Why is there so much DLC? Why is this all popping up right now? <clears throat> that one looks pretty cool. Battle Horde Castle. I'll, I'll take a castle for myself. That sounds pretty sweet. Goblins. Ah, take all. Gotta get used to that. Hello, rat. Got him. Alright. I'm gonna try to get out of this sewer before we end today's episode. I don't know if I'll be able to do it or not. This is a nice weapon, I have to say. Got a door. It's a sealed door. Ah, it's the exit. Yeah, we're done. I was expecting it to take a little while longer than that to get out. Oh my god. So many... So much DLC. Okay. All right. And here is Cyrodiil. Not quite as pretty as Skyrim, but it has its own charm. There's a little mud crab over here. Gonna go show him a taste of his own medicine. There you go. Screw you, mud crab. Crab meat. All right, we've, it's only been about 18, 19 minutes. So I think I'll keep going a little while longer. Let's take a look at the map. Okay. Um, yeah, well, there's not much of a map right now, but it looks like that way is the direction we're supposed to be going. Um, considering I can't see anything on my map and there's no way to zoom out so let's just go to the quest marker i think that's a good starting place now let's see i guess bruma is up there somewhere i'm pretty sure bruma's in this game right i'd like to go to bruma i want to see how the Beyond Skyrim Bruma compares to the actual Cyrodiil Bruma in this game.
think that would be pretty cool. Did it say we could fast travel? I can't seem to... There's, there's like nothing on my map. So I guess we're just gonna wander out. Let's just make sure that we're following the right quest. Yeah, okay, we are. Oh! Well, there's a world map. Oh, yeah, here's Bruma. I kind of want to just go to Bruma. Alright, well, let's, let's continue on with the main quest for now. We'll go talk to this guy, and we'll sort of end off this episode here. And then next time, we can just fast travel over to Bruma. Let's do that. Yeah, let's go. Because I, I really want to check out that area. I've arrived at the Priory. Take the amulet to draw free. I mean, I should probably just leave the amulet me. When you give amulets to NPCs, they tend to lose I'm them. I'm the shepherd here. Eranor the name. And this is Waynon Priory. Yeah, where's Joffrey? If he's not sleeping or eating, he'll be fussing with his books, I reckon, over in the Priory house. Alright. Is it? Stop talking. Wow. Your, uh, your construction here isn't so great. The rain is just coming straight through. Alright. Well, let's see. Where can we go now? Looks like the Priory is in here. Let's go in. Yes? Can I help you? Yeah, where's Joffrey? He's upstairs. Go ahead. Thanks. Uh, oh, yeah, don't mind that. Joffrey? I'm Brother Joffrey. Joffrey! Uh, I brought you the Amulet of the Kings. This cannot be. No one but the Emperor is... Yeah, here you go. By the nine. Who are you? How did you get this? What do you know of the Emperor's death? Uh, yeah, here you go. Here's the last words. As unlikely as your story sounds, I believe you. Only the strange destiny of Uriel Septim could have brought you to me carrying the Amulet of Kings. Uh, who's the Prince of Destruction? The Prince of Destruction he referred to is none other than Merun's Dagon, one of the lords of the demonic world of Oblivion. The Emperor's words, close shut the jaws of Oblivion, certainly suggest that he perceived some threat from Oblivion. But all the scholars agree that the mortal world is protected from the Daedra of Oblivion by magical barriers. Uh -huh. I'm not sure. Only the Emperors truly understand the meaning behind the rituals of coronation. The Amulet of Kings is ancient. Saint Alicia herself received it from the gods. It is All a holy right. relic of great power. When an emperor is crowned, he uses the amulet to light the dragon fires at the Temple of the One in the Imperial City. With the emperor dead and no new heir crowned, the dragon fires in the temple will be dark for the first time in centuries. All right. It may be that the dragon fires protected us from a threat that only the emperor was aware of. What about his son? I am one of the few who know of his existence. Many years ago, I served as captain of Uriel's bodyguards, the Blades. One night, Uriel called me into his private chambers. A baby boy lay sleeping in a basket. Uriel told me to deliver him somewhere safe. He never told me anything else about the baby, but I knew it was his son. From time to time, he would ask about the child's progress. Now it seems that this illegitimate son is the heir to the Septim throne, if he yet lives. Where is he? His name is Martin. He serves Akatosh in the chapel in the city of Kvach. You must go to Kvach and find him at once. If the enemy is aware of his existence, as seems likely, right. he Terrible is... Terrible danger. And please, let me know if there's anything you need. My resources here are limited, but I will help in any way I can. Cool. All right. Well. Waste no time. You must find Martin before the end. 
let's uh, go ahead and save that here. And I think I'm going to go ahead and leave that. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. See ya!